Reverence and curiosity for the cultural traditions of others has been a constant theme throughout my plight. I trust that this glimpse into my creative journey will touch the right person at the right time and somehow do some good. This is our field family field trip on the Whoa, day of a giant bird. In addition to experiencing an Italian tradition with the family, in the spirit of miracles, I thought it would be a great opportunity to put some of the go back in Art Go Show. What is the holiday today? Festa dell'Immacolata Concezione. So it's adopted? No. So it's a God well, give a baby. You're putting us up for adoption? <laughs> no, the Virgin Mary, the Immaculate Conception of Jesus, is a holiday that is celebrated by Catholics, yes. Italy. We are in Italy. Yes. And so are we going to Greta to have a service. Woo! When it comes to broader religious and cultural traditions, I've always felt like sort of an observer, thrilled to share the joy of what it means to others. Here we are at the Chiesa of Greta. Alessandro's having a friendly chat with the priest, Don Leo. He's super awesome. He's like the rock star of the priest world. Bene. Allora, ci andiamo a preparare per la messa. Ci vediamo fra poco. What do you have in your bag there? I have my phone, my gloves, and my pocket. I got money. <laughs> I left my my umbrella, I left my jacket, I left my everything on. Mm -hmm. With permission and care to be respectful, I hope to capture highlights of the traditional Italian Catholic Immaculate Conception Mass. <laughs> customary to eat a feast with family at home or if you make a reservation which we didn't pasta meat uh, stuff like this you know, meat, pizza, or mm -hmm. mm -hmm. <laughs> the, that's the conad the grand opening Oh, 
The variable in that saying about life being what happens when you're making other plans is the attitude of willingness to watch it unfold. It's an inauguration. It's a party, right? <laughs> Look at the balloons! <laughs> The parking? I have no idea. What a coincidence! Riding into him! The Conad is sort of like a Walmart and the superstore is has a little bit of everything. People's senses light up in anticipation of an attraction. I anticipate sensory overload. A little bit of optimism never hurt anyone. Fun ad is taking over the world. Taking over anyone. Menu collection. You can have a coffee or cappuccino. Brioche, one orange for just four bucks. Wow. Say happy Christmas. Merry Christmas. Awesome. Why do you say happy Christmas? Because it's happy. downstairs. Can, can we use a Walmart? <laughs> it does. Can we use a restroom? This looks like a Walmart. Find a restroom. Let's just take a quick tour to understand. Look, look at that tile. I love this tile. It is so cool. cool. This is amazing. Oh, and it even has a sensor. Wait, how does this work? Ah! <laughs> Nifty. Won't get locked in this one. I hope. This is the coolest bathroom I swear I have ever seen. Check it out. Look, we have, just put your hand under, under, comes the soap, then, <laughs> it is so cool. Okay, just put your hand under and comes the water. <laughs> I've never seen anything like this. It's like I've lived under a rock or something. It is so cool. Really, like, it is super with the cool retro tile. And then, and then, and then, last but not least, go, go, you're not going to believe it. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> Woo! Is that not the coolest ever? I have never been so excited in my life. Do you know what they have? You have this one? They have, you have to try it. You guys have to try it. It's awesome. It's a beautiful, beautiful old fashioned tile. And then they have on here, there's a little tray. Everybody brings water, but you put your hand under one part, and it's a soap. You move to the left, it's a water. You move to the left, and it dries it. Right there, all in the sink. It is spectacular. It is spectacular. Want to try? Yeah, bye. It's going with We put, do it, do it, do it. Put your hand under, quick. Oh, the simple amusements. We can't remind ourselves enough that appreciating the simple things keeps us in shape to appreciate greater ones. Mom, look, SpongeBob's house. Yeah, the casse, but if they don't have it, they don't have it. Okay. Watch, boys. You close. Uh huh. Step two. Okay. Secchiello. Secchiello? Oh, secchiello. Oh, it's cut pineapple juice. Yeah, it's going to cut the pineapple for you. Step 3. Premere per avvio. What do you think? What do you think? That is the candle. Here's the Christmas. Where Don Leo gets his stuff. Even in the United States, I found that people are nostalgic, if not prideful, in their culinary traditions. In most cultures around the world, food is like a religious experience. Oh, look. Is that hot or what? Relax. 
And it's not our turn yet. We have to wait. Hmm? Turn of what? To order. Ordering on Hangry, trying to get out of the store in true to nomadic form. How could we possibly wait and sit up at a table for our feast? I grabbed two, too. Oh. Okay, now that we've filled up the cart with all this deli stuff, here we are. The vestiges of tradition prove profound, whatever rituals they may entail. They seep into the subconscious, and we can call upon them in our times of stress. So it gives me pause to be more mindful and reflect. Whatever one's traditions are, wherever in the world, whether simple or elaborate, with more or less, we are truly blessed. Well, was that a wonderful picnic? Yes. It was a wonderful picnic. Yes. So we went to the church. This one festival wasn't open. The other festival wasn't open. There we got walked by the market. So we found ourselves to the Conad. Super opening. And then we had a glorious picnic in the freeze. Coffee time. If you want, you sit here. Yeah. yeah. Otherwise, we can go inside the tender. Okay. I leave it in here. Guys, yeah. we'll come to the Christmas tree. Wow! Everything's in the spirit already. So cute. You can, so cute with your little hat. Pick one. Pick one thing. <laughs> Wait, so what happened? I lost two. <gasps> How many? Oh, I was eating. How many do you have left? Three. I saw the x-ray and you presume that he's recycling. He's recycling the tooth for, for cheap the patina de dente. <laughs> the These teeth are not fake. Look. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna save up till I become Mr. Beast. One second to make it. Give you a million dollars, you're gonna blow a million dollars. Trying to be like Mr. Beast. I wanna be nice. One camera, 24 hour home attached to the satellite. Totally. And record everything what happened during the day. Why are we recording the cat in the tree? <laughs> he's okay with people. He's being sweet until he scratches. He's a cute photo. Careful, he's okay. Don't make alarming sounds or her. <laughs> okay, guys. I want to pet him. I want to bring him home. Oh. Oh. Wow. It's so beautiful, but I can't seem to capture the essence of it. God, it's just gorgeous. Okay, go ahead and get out of the road here. They say it's the little things that add up. And it makes me think, maybe it's befriending a neighborhood animal. Maybe it's a winter picnic. What are the traditions that we're forming today? What are the traditions we would like for tomorrow? We survived, we survived a long day out in the, in the round. Oh. Whew. Okay, no castles, no uh, festivals, nothing like that, but at least we had a nice picnic in the park. The and church was awesome. It's awesome that we know like a cool priest. So anyway, yada yada. Today's traditions to my 